Hi everybody, Dr. Joseph Cipriano here. Uh, just want to let you know the next giveaway, what we're doing, is going to be another $200 giveaway. Um, this time, in order to win that $200, what we need, we need a little help from you. So we're coming up with our new merchandise store and we need an idea, a very creative idea for a t-shirt to be put out there. So when trying to win this money for the next giveaway, I need you obviously to be subscribed to the channel, to like the video, but then also comment on what creative idea or slogan should be for the next t-shirt or for the actually the first t-shirt um, for the Dr. Joseph Cipriano channel. So I'm looking forward to hearing these creative ideas. Uh, have a good one and obviously the most creative idea for the t-shirt will win. Enjoy the video. This shoulder right here is up higher. Uh, good amount than compared to this one. So there is definitely a little bit of a scoliosis going on here. Um, not much, but as you guys can tell, you can see the where my hands are on the top of the shoulders. Now how are those shoulders looking? Let's see. A lot better. How did you feel after that Y strap? Oh, really good. It took a, I could feel it. Just let it, it just brought it out. It's just a lot of relief with yeah, that, Yeah, a right? lot of relief with that. Good. More people should use that thing. <laughs> that was a great deal of help right there. Good. Hi everybody, I'm Dr. Joseph Cipriano, and today we have our patient here. Um, so kind of what we've been going over, you've been having some, just some neck issues in through here, but I would say that chief complaint is really the, the low back. So you kind of had an episode where it just kind of threw, threw on on you one day. You know, like you said, when you were getting out of your truck, literally went right to the ground and it took you a while to get back up, but you were able to after a little bit. Um, how long ago was that? Um, that's been probably about eight months or so ago. Okay. So has that, have you had any big flare up like that since? Uh, here and there it's flared up some, but nothing like that day. I mean, that okay. was one of the days where it, I didn't know if I was going to be able to get in the door or not. <laughs> okay. All right. And that was typically, that was over that right side, correct? Yes. All right. So when, it, when that did happen, that was here, did that just shoot all the way down the legs or, um, or was it just mainly like the low back and stayed in the low back? I, I, I think mainly it stayed in the low back. I didn't really feel, uh, I can feel it there. One side's bigger than the other now, uh, and you can feel that too. Probably yeah. when you get it, but um, right, that must uh, mainly it stayed there. Uh, it didn't really shoot down my leg any. I okay. Don't think. Okay. So that's correct. So that's mainly that's that chief complaint right there today. Yeah, that, that and the the neck part of here. I can hear. It. So yeah, you hear like some crunching every time. Yeah. You hear move around and I can definitely help you with that as well. Um, so let's get a baseline, let's just see where you're at. Um, I'm going to have you look all the way up to the ceiling. Any issues with that? Mm, no. Okay. Look all the way down to the floor for me. Any issues there? I feel a little bit there. Okay. Where at through here? Or is that where right. on your neck? I'm feeling it. Yeah, in here. Okay, right into there. Gotcha. And then if you were to bring one ear, bring it down to one shoulder, any pain, any issues with that? Tightness, pulling? Uh, yeah, I can feel some tightness. Okay. Tightness, I would describe it as tightness. Gotcha. And then if you do it to the other side? Yeah, uh, just popping again. Popping again? <laughs> yeah. Okay. And then if you were to rotate and look over either shoulder? Yeah, I can feel the tightness. A lot of tightness. Yeah. Okay. All right, what I'm going to do, maybe sit up nice and straight, I'm going to push down on the top of your head. Any pain with that? No, not really. Okay, I'm going to have you turn to the side. Any pain there? No. Good, and turn to this side. Any pain with that? No. Good, okay. So I'm going to have you stand up now. I'm going to have you bend forward at the waist. Any issues with that? Um. Right in here, a little bit, I can feel some tightness. Okay. All right, so he's pointing basically right to that L5 spinous process is where he's pointing. 
if you're to lean and extend back like this, any issues with that? Yeah, I can feel some in my neck and down here. Okay, so in the neck and down there. Yeah. Gotcha. Now, if you're to lean to one side, any issues with that? Pulling on that side? Yeah. Okay, and on the other side? No. No. Okay. And then if you're to rotate over either side, any issues with that? No, not really. Okay. All right. Maybe just a little, but not much. Okay, or was that just what, like a tightness pulling type thing? Yeah. Okay. All right, so what I'm going to have you do, um, well, we are going to have you lay face down. Uh, one thing, though, while you're standing there, just so everyone does know, as you guys can tell, the shoulder right here is up higher, uh, good amount than compared to this one. So there is definitely a little bit of a scoliosis going on here. Um, not much, but as you guys can tell, you can see the where my hands are on the top of the shoulder. So that's one thing to just kind of to notify you about. But I'll have you lay face down for me. So how I like to start all the adjustments is we're going to scan the body from up top here and we're going to go all the way down to the feet and then we're also going to scan the body uh, looking at the symmetry from the right side and compare it to the left side here. Um, so when I palpate in, let me know if anything is tender to the touch, okay? So as I'm pushing in here, okay, any issues through there? Just a little bit right in, in that area, a little bit higher up, yeah, okay. right in there. Alright, so right around T1, and we're going to keep dropping down through the thoracic spine. And now we're getting into that lumbar spine here. Oh yeah. Okay, so right at the base. Okay, any pain over that right SI joint? Not really? Uh, a little bit. A little bit, okay. Any pain directly over the sacrum? No. Any pain over the left side? Yeah. Okay, so a little bit of pain over that left side. Um, yeah, and actually as I was coming down, it's not much of a, just a very slight degree, very slight curvature, so. Um, but it is causing, as you guys can tell, that one shoulder um, differential. And then when we come in, let's take a look at the leg length. So your left leg is pulling short here on this side. So we'll make sure and um, check towards the end of the adjustments how that is going for you. Okay. But first, what we're going to do, we're going to use the hypervolt and we're going to relax the entire back for you. Sound good? Sound good. <laughs> good. This thing's pretty powerful, isn't it? Yeah, it feels good, man. <laughs> okay. I know they tell where all the air right there. Yeah. Oh. Yeah. It's right, yeah, right in here. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Yeah, we'll go through with the adjustment. Okay. Focus on that spot for you. But alright, let's come up here. 
and this is no 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 say that I come up here. Oh, okay. This is where I'm gonna start from that uh, that adjustment at the top of the table here, doing that cervical thoracic joint here. Now I know you were feeling some issues on T1, so we're gonna go on T1 on that left side here. There we go. Drop down to T2 on the right here. There we go. Got good movement through there. Yeah. Okay, take a deep breath in. Exhale out. Okay, let's drop down a little bit. One more time, deep breath in. And out. Okay. Yeah, so you're not really wanting to move in that prone position, but that's why I do the adjustment in the that standing intercostal. And then we'll also do it in the supine or the anterior adjustment. So let's come back down here. Let's check that leg length out again. Actually, even before that left leg was short, it's almost almost exactly even, which is a good thing. So just those two adjustments up top got a ton of movement for you. All right, I'm gonna stabilize on the sacrum. I want you to raise that right leg up for me. Any pain, tenderness, tightness with that? Yeah, a little bit. A little bit there. Yeah. All right, relax that side. Raise this side for me. How does that side compare to the other? Yeah, about the same. So a little bit of tightness on both? Yeah. Okay, so what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna have you first cross this foot over that foot. Good. Table's gonna come up. Okay, now I want you to switch. Yep, just like that. Cross. Okay. Now raise this leg up for me first. How does that feel? A little better. Good? Yeah. Relax that side. Raise this side up for me. How does that side feel? Yes, yeah, about a little better too. Good. So yeah, we're opening up those joints a little bit, but what we're also going to do, because a lot of it is also in that lumbar spine, so I'm going to have you turn on your side and face me this way. Okay. Good. Yep, we're going to bend that top knee. I just want to bring it down just a little bit. Right there. Right there. Good. There we go. Flip to the other side for me. I didn't really feel that one move much. We'll get it. Alright, I want you to lay just flat on your back for me. Flat? Yep. Okay. Okay. So with this, what we're going to do, we're going to do those leg pulls where you get some relief from the ankle, knee, going into that hip as well. So okay. just relax the leg. I'm going to have you relax right here. Let your arms go. Just lay back. Uh, rest your hands on your stomach for me. Good. Okay. So now we're going to go in with the wide strap. Really just open everything up with this here. Okay. So I'm going to have you lift your head up. Good. And relax. Okay. There for me. There we go. Yeah, you were definitely very tight. Did not want to move that well, as you could tell. So your body just was holding and fighting in a lot of the different techniques. But yes. How did you feel after that wide strap? Oh, really good. It took. A, I could feel it. Just let it. It just brought it out. It's just a lot of relief. With yeah, that, a lot right? of relief with that. Good. Good. Yes. <laughs> Have you ever had that done before? No. Okay. How would you describe that to somebody who's never had that done? Uh, 
I would say that, that I've been to several chiropractors and they've made adjustments, but I, that's kind of like instant relief. Um, that I think more people should use that thing. That, <laughs> oof, that was a great deal of help right there. Got it. All right, I'm gonna have you sit on up. There we go. All right, so I know in the beginning, you kind of had that like, kind of crick in your neck, a little crunching a bit. How does that feel now if you look up, look down? Oh, I've got, it feels like a lot more motion in it now. And I don't feel that uh, tightness that I had. And it's actually, that, that helped a whole lot, yes. <laughs> Good. Yeah, I can feel a difference already. Good, that's exactly what I like to hear. Cause yeah, even, even in the beginning, um, you get that decompression, but a lot of the times you still really don't get the full effect of the decompression until like tomorrow morning after you wake up, once your body's relaxed. Because what that's doing instantaneously, yes, it's taking pressure off those nerve roots, but anywhere there is pain and any of those pain receptor signals that are, um, that are originally have been getting sent out, Sometimes it takes them a while to come back and to, to retrace back. So that's why I typically say usually 24 to 48 hours after, you're going to notice even more of the effect with that Y strap. Now, how are those shoulders looking? Let's see. A lot better. <laughs> They're like literally almost even. Wow. Yeah, I, I think. Oh, oh from the from the um, yeah from the beginning. Yeah, yeah. Right. well, it was this one that was wow. yeah a lot higher. Yeah. So yeah, that Y strap with that did that just pulled everything even straight. So instead of your spine having that, I mean, and it was such a slight bit, but that slight bit of curve, it pulled it straight, and even your shoulder height that was that like little this. bit of difference made a. I mean, it may bend just a little bit, but I, that I could tell it came out. So. Even with that, just that little bit of difference. You already noticed that much. I already noticed it, yeah. You'll get to yeah. see it in the video once we post it. Your shoulders were way off in the beginning. <laughs> okay. That's incredible. Good. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> Good. All right. Well, if anyone is looking to schedule an appointment, um, just go right to the website, drjosephcipriano.com. Um, typically, it takes about a day or two for us to reply to you, but I'd love to get you in here. Have a good one, everybody.